Hey everybody, Dr. Red here, and we are back with even more Undertale. We left off, we saved, saw some snow dogs, and this rad cow bull lady? A dog just rushed in here filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a snow dog that expressed its own emotions. But, as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. Its neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until it was rather sad to watch, but I couldn't turn away. Oh yeah, inspiration dog. Let's go. Ah, shit ass. <laughs> what the hell, you guys? It's a snow papyrus. It's a lump of snow with the word sans written on it. You tried sans, I I'll give you that, but I have no idea what the hell to do with these. I'm just having flashbacks to Pokemon. You know, unless I just nail it right now. Oh my god, is it happening? Holy shit, oh my god! <laughs> Hell yeah! God damn! Mm. Continue behind these scary trees. And we're gonna check out what's below- No, that's where Sands is. That sounds like progression. We're gonna go exploring. It's a snow puff! Woof. Is there a woof in here? What a tiny doghouse! Or is this progression? Uh-oh. <gasps> oh, it's so little. It's cute. Oh. <laughs> He's a big boy. It's the greater... <laughs> His spear has a little doggo on it. I'm gonna beckon the greater dog. Come here, boy. It bounds towards you. Like King Slobber in my face. Don't hurt me, great po- uh, Ow! It's seeking affection. Greater dog, I will pet you. Curls up in your lap, I don't want you so big! It falls asleep. Z, 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 z. And then it wakes up. It's so excited. Do you want to play, puppy? Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, shit ass. What did it say? Greater dog is patting the ground. Oh, I know what that means. That means you want to play. You make a snowball and throw for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow, brings it to you. Dog is very tired and it rests its head on my... Ah, f fuck nugget. He wants some TLC. Tender love and care. He wants some petting then. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire... This is how I die. My movement's slow, but you still haven't petted enough. Ah, shit. Head capacity is at 40% and we're at really low health. You pet him again. You pet decisively. It reaches 100%. The dog flops over with his legs in the air. <laughs> Greater dog is contented. You won. Yes, 40 gold. <laughs> it was just a puppy in a suit of armor. <laughs> oh, his little butt. <laughs> That's really cute. We're gonna go down here and see Sans, though. Assuming he's still here. That's creepy. He's not here now, though. Random encounter. Ugh. What's a gift trot? Can I, 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 I had some googly eyes. Gosh and darn teenage googly ass. I don't think I can get hit once right now. That stumbles <laughs> Let's decorate it again. I can't improve on perfection. <laughs> it stumbles blindly. Undeck great. You remove the googly eyes. Thanks for nothing. Sorry, asshole. Laments well, its lack of hands. Can I gift it hands? How do I know it's not a trick? I just want to not die here, man. You distrust my youthful demeanor. You remove the barbed wire made of pipe cleaners. That's a little bit. Oh no, he just got, he got vandalized. Uh oh. 
Safe present is the one on the right. It's slightly less irritated. Undecorated again. You removed the lenticular bookmark of a smug teen winking. Aw oh, man, I'm helping. If Tron is slightly less irritated, oh man, we're gonna keep on decorating him. There was a striped cane that said, I use this tiny cane to walk on it. A weight has been lifted. His problems have been taken away. Does that mean we can mercy it? Yeah, man. Ooh, a spooky cave. Yo. Yo? It's a door. Yo, it's a door. I don't know how to open that. I'm assuming, I'm hoping it'll tell me later, or maybe I missed out on content of some sort by not going this way instead of fighting the, the, the greater dot. Ooh. Can I interact with any of these weird, creepy eyeballs? No? All right. And random encounter. There's Mercy right away. I mean, I'll start undecorating again. Oh, chicken nugget stocking. That's really gross. No, do the present attack. It's so much easier. Undecorate. Non-dog related raisins. Is that it? Is that all he's got on him? There we go. We're fine. Slightly less agitated. Undecorated again. The barbed wire is gone. Oh, weight has been lifted. Mercy you again, my man. You gotta stop fighting me. I'll just undecorate you for free, dude. <laughs> Puppy. Nice long bridge. Nothing can go wrong here, right? Oh boy. Human! This is your final and most dangerous challenge! Behold the gauntlet of deadly terror! <laughs> There's a dog. <laughs> when I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it. Well, uh, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm I'm about to activate it now. That uh, <laughs> that doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems, may be too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we, we, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct, no class at all. Away it goes. Puppy now? Phew. What are you looking at? This was another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, I think he likes me. I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I'd make sure I understand blue attacks. Flower. Sign. Welcome to Snowden Town. That's it? That's all you're going to get me? Can't even loot this flower? Shop. Cool. We're going to save really quickly at the sight of such a friendly town. Is going to fill me with determination. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? Okay. Hi, bunny. Um, hello. Hiya. Welcome to Snowden. Can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where did you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? What to do here? You want to know what to do here in Snowden? Grillby's has food. Library has info. You're tired, you can take a nap. It's right next door. My sister runs it. 
And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think they just showed up one day and uh, asserted themselves. Town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Think back to your history class. A long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in that forest. Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost, you can burrow under the door forget about it. What about you, Rabbit? Life... Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That life, ain't it? I mean, I'll buy some stuff from you, man. Feels 11, 22 HP. Oh, I can't eat it twice. Ice, ugh. I mean, maybe I'll take the... Yeah, the manly bandana, because I could use the, d the defense. <laughs> Alright. I'd love it. Yeah, thank you. So I can heal for 11 twice, or just... For... I'll do 11 twice. Thanks, man. Bye now. Come again soon. Neat. Box is still a box. What's up, in? Dog? Mom says that sleeping can cover your health above your maximum HP. What's maximum HP? Well, I'm snowed in in. Sounds premier hotel. One night is 80 gold, you yeah, stay. Here's your room key, make sure to bundle up. <laughs> oh man, thin walls. Hi, you look like you had a great sleep. Which is incredible, because you were only up there for two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. <laughs> cool. Whose house is this, though? Don't want to walk to the other side of town? Try the under snow tunnels. Oh! Oh, sh Jesus Christ. This is a big-ass town. We're going exploring. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Rude. Isn't my little cinnamon just the cutest? The bun buns are so adorable to he he. Awful teens tormented a local monster by decorating its tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. And that's a tradition to put presents underneath a decorated tree. It's a carefully decorated tree. Some of the presents are addressed from Santa to various locals. Hi, weirdo. Yo, you're a kid too, right? I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt. Who's this rad bear? This town doesn't have a mayor. But if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about... Okay. <laughs> That's politics. <laughs> okay. Aw, oh, rad. Aw, oh, the two dogs. Aw, oh, doggos. You better watch what you sit down in here, kid, because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish these skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. Hey, you were the dog that was smoking that those trees. I think I'm getting a spike collar to show off my personality. Make some statement like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk. Can I sit down next to him? <laughs> it's playing poker against itself. It appeared. Oh. I put out a line for some girls today. Somebody told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. I'm literally gonna make out with a fish. Aw, that was your fishing line. Those dogs are part of the royal guard, the elite military group led by Undine. She's a rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's a wonder how the kids want to be like her when they grow up. I like your bar, man. Grilbs said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. 
The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm. <laughs> I don't want to see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip on their butts. The jukebox is broken. Okay. Herm isn't human food different from monster food. Does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try sometime. No matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help, I want new drinks and <laughs> hot guys. Do you want help? I guess the bartender's kind of <laughs> hot. Weird. Nice scarf, dude. Everybody's always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. During this crowding lack of sunlight, I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. You and me both, Scarf Guy. Hi, Satan. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyways. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? The libra- The library? Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report that we can just fill it in with comics and games. <laughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time, but look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. That look in your eye, you're somebody that has difficulty solving Junior Jumble, aren't ya? Yeah, I think it's kind of hard. Aw oh, man, someone has them checking their mail. Papyrus, this is their house. It's empty. That would have been kind of rude, like rifling through his mail, though, I'm not gonna lie. Let's play Monsters and Humans! Oh, that's a mo- Oh, they're blob people! You aren't gonna make me be the human again, are you? Oh, to be young again, the world sure felt boundless. Knock, knock. Ah, oh, what a beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. My patience rewards me. Ah. Oh. Man, that person really likes my... What you doing? I guess I can't find out. Oh, ring, ring, ring! Hello? Can I speak to to G? Wait a second. It's Is this the wrong number? Oh, it's the wrong number. The wrong, wrong number song. We're very sorry that we got it wrong. Oh, it's the wrong number. The wrong number song. We're very, very sorry we got wrong. Click. I am so sorry you guys had to deal with me singing this now. Holy shit. So we went to the library, Abby. Went through Papyrus's mail. Let's go in his house. It's locked. Can't look in the window either? Shucks. What about the shed, though? It's locked from the inside. Aw, oh, man, that's the ice that the dog, the El Dago was throwing. It's getting... very spoopy. Um... I think that's a Papyrus shadow. Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the administration for another puzzle solver's skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the great Papyrus, will be your... Friend? No. No? This is all wrong. I can't be your friend. 
You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard. Oh, I don't want to fight you. Papyrus blocks your way. Um, Papyrus. I don't want to. I'm not insulting. Him. Do I have to flirt with him? What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. It's in red. W w well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. I can make spaghetti. Oh no, you're meeting all my standards. <laughs> I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date later, after I capture you. I guess I did get more help from health from sleeping at the end. White bones bad. Don't hit white bones. Pyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Let's flirt again. Oh no! Let's date date later after I capture you. What about I flirt with you one more time? You flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting won't escalate this battle. Let Let's date later after I capture you. Hmm. Maybe I just walk away. So we won't fight. Then let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. That was really hard. Oh, shit. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> You're blue now. Pyrus is too busy fighting to flirt back. Let's... Oh, uh, no. Jump. Jump. Jump! Fire steps an MTT brand of Bishi cream behind his ear. Spare him. Wh what? I'm not thinking about that date thing! Ooh, sir cops! Yes! Mmm! Fire dabs more anime power behind his ears. Yeah, don't don't make me use my special attack. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. The virus dabs more cute juice. Now some cute juice behind his ears. Awesome. I can almost taste my future popularity. Ooh. ooh. Papyrus dabs some more attraction slime behind his ear. Damn boy. Papyrus, head of the royal guy. Oh shit. Ooh, sh oh, butthole. Oh. Some beauty yogurt behind his ear. Papyrus, unparalleled spaghetti attore. Whoop. Shit ass. Ugh, ugh. He realized he doesn't have ears. Hold on. Mercy. Spare. Undyne will be really proud of me. There we go. One more. There we go. He's rattling in his bones. The king will trip ahead in the shape of my smile. Papyrus is rattling his bones still. Mercy again. My my brother, well, he, he won't change very much. Shit. He whispers. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll have lots of admirers, but, but... Smells like bones. Will, will, will anyone like me as, as sincerely as you? Shit. 
watch it. Uh oh. <laughs> We're gonna have to use an item to heal. Um. We got the bicycle. That's like, uh, you know, 11 HP. That'll get us through another attack. Someone, someone like you is, is really rare. Shit. He's considering his options. And dating might, might be kind of hard. He whispers near here again. After you're captured and sent away. Ooh. He's cackling now. Ah, oh, who cares? Give up. <laughs> He's considering options still. Give up or face my special attack. Shit. Shit. He's preparing a bone attack or something, but we gotta eat this unicycle. Yeah, very soon I will use my special attack. Please do it sooner than rather than later, because I'm like out of HP, my man. <laughs> Mercy you again, boy. Not too long. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Please do it. You still can't. <laughs> this is your last chance. He's trying hard to play cool. Spare him. Behold my special. What the heck? <laughs> it's a topic. That, that's my special attack. Hey, hey you stupid. D do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Oh, well. I'll just use a really cool regular- oh shit. Sorry, here's an absolutely normal attack. Uh oh. Oh shit, but <laughs> No, I'm at 1H. You're too weak, I was easily a I will now send you to or oh, oh, SNs calls it our garbage. You're in the dark house now. <laughs> oh. Unfortunately it's just dry food. It's this it's a squeaky two toy. It's too small to sleep on. It's enough from Papyrus. Sorry, I have to mock you in the guest room until Undyne arrives. Feel free to make yourself at home. Refreshments and accommodations have been provided. Yeah, <laughs> yours, Papyrus. All right. So we're <laughs> we are locked in his basement right now. <laughs> so I'll be I'm gonna leave cut cut it here again. As usual, thanks so much for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe. If you want to see more, it'll be coming in the next day or so. But for now, I'm Doctor Ed, and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now, everybody.